Hello traders, it's Samurai Trader here. Welcome to this training session. This session is going to be a little different. It's not a session on the world's best trading setup strategies or ideas. I'm going to be talking about head stuff. If you're not earning at least $100,000 a year as a trader, you need to be watching this video from start to end. This is not about selling your product. It's all about selling you my course. This is about how to make lasting change. I deal with hundreds of traders around the world. I deal with professional full-time day traders. I deal with prop traders. I deal with new traders and experienced traders. In fact, over 70% of my students are already experienced in the world of trading. And one of the greatest challenges that they have in trading each and every day is the person that they see when they look at the mirror, the person staring back at them. I'm going to be running through a strategy that has the potential of changing your life forever. However, as the last line says on this slide, the mind is like a parachute. It only works if it's open. You've probably heard me say this in other video recordings. The sign of an intelligent person is how open they are to new ideas. And unfortunately, so many traders become jaded that they, they lose the ability to be open minded. And likewise, I'm going to aim this at some of my older traders. One of the challenges that we have as we age at times is we become more closed minded. Well, it doesn't matter what your age bracket is, what I'm going to cover has the opportunity or the potential to change your day trading or trading full stop career forever. So in this session, I'm going to be covering a lot of information. So please take notes, pause the recording if necessary and replay if required. NLP neuro linguistic strategies can be life changing. So please approach this with an open minded. Let me say it again with an open mind because NLP works. So let me give you some background very quickly. NLP is known as neuro linguistic programming. It's a study of verbal and nonverbal communication. It was put together uh, in the 1970s by two brilliant men, Richard Bandler and John Grindler. Uh, please feel free to spend some time and look them up on some of their videos they have. Uh, they haven't worked together as, as a team for many years now. They've gone their separate roads. But there's a lot of videos on YouTube of them doing their work and a lot of people they've trained and also a lot of papers, a lot of articles written on Google. It's really well worth spending some time in researching them. I actually uh, attended a seminar, I think it was in 1984, by John Grindler down in uh, Melbourne, Australia at the Hilton Hotel. I'll never forget this. So the, the seminar started on the Friday and it finished on the Sunday. First of all, on the Friday afternoon when John started the, the workshop, there would have been probably 200 of us there. This gentleman in a pair of jeans and a casual shirt was in the front of a room and he had this little hand drum. And as you twisted this drum, it had like these little balls that flopped from side to side. Boom, 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 boom. And I, I don't know what they actually call it. So he's at the front of a room and then he walks up on stage and he's got this little drum. Boom, 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 boom. As he twists it and his little balls curl backwards and forwards and hit the drum. And what he started to do was to what we call, what I now know, is pace the audience. And he started to slow it down. But in the end, it was going boom, 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 boom. And the amazing part is the audience, who were previously talking quite loudly, all started to go very quiet. And the room went silent. And what he was, this is one of the strategies. He was pacing the audience. And just one more story of that workshop. On the Sunday morning, John walks in at nine o'clock wearing a suit. Now, please remember um, or realize the whole workshop, he'd been in a pair of jeans and a casual shirt and even a t-shirt, if I remember correctly. And he walks into the seminar and he's wearing a suit. And virtually everybody was saying to him uh, that he passed, oh, how come you're wearing a suit? How come you're wearing a suit? He stood on stage and he said, always be prepared for change. 
always be prepared for, for change. And he walked out the room and cha got changed back into his pair of jeans and come back in again. After all these years, 30 odd years, I still remember that workshop. So he, just what they teach is literally amazing. Now, what I've got to say here is that um, I haven't spent days putting this together. Uh, once again, you're not paying me to do this little um, uh, presentation. So excuse me if the slides are all over the place and everything's not perfect traders. Uh, but what I want to get across though is a really important message and something that I promise you from today, you can have a dramatic change in your trading results and you'll see why in a moment. Uh, I must say I'm not an NLP practitioner. Um, my goal is to share with you what works for me so you can discover what options are available for you and taking your career to the next level. I use NLP extensively for my own traders and in my own trading itself. And you'll discover why if you're not familiar with NLP, why it works so well. Many of you have heard of Tony Robbins. Tony Robbins actually uh, went in partnership on a number of projects with John Grindler many years ago. So Tony Robbins, most of his work is based upon the teachings of NLP and his own research. So John, uh, actually Richard Bandler says this. Richard says in life there are three things we all need to do. We need to get, th get two things. That is we've got to get things done. We need to get through things, uh, major projects, and we need to get over things. Some of the things that are holding us back in our past. What I'm going to be showing you today, the swish pattern, this can do that. Now, I'm going to be running a number of, if you haven't seen my other seminar or, or little workshop I did a few days ago or a week or so ago, I spoke a little about NLP. So I'm going to be doing some more workshops on anchoring uh, on the rubber band technique and some others because they all work in hand in hand. However, they also can be stand alone. That is, you don't have to see any of the other little workshops I'm going to record for you. So let's start with this slide here. Am I seeing the opportunities or only the obstacles? Now, here in Australia, we have highways where you'll drive for miles and miles and basically hardly any trees. Uh, and probably the country you come from, no doubt, has got areas like that. However, every month, virtually, we hear of people running off the road in a car accident and hitting the tree and it may be the only tree for miles. They may run off and hit a pole and it may be the only pole for hundreds of meters. Yet why is it they focus on that? Well what tends to happen and let me relate it back to trading we tend to focus on what is not working or we tend to focus on our fears. What the swish pattern will do is allow us to refocus uh, and redirect our thoughts. Now, another amazing thing about NLP, and this can be true for all sorts of challenges that we have in our lives. You solve one problem, you solve many, and I call it the ripple effect. Now, we're going to go through a reframing technique and some of the swish ideas in a moment. But what you'll actually discover if you install these patterns, you'll become a much help, uh, happier, healthier and more confident and competent person as you undertake these skills. So this is a, a great quote that I saw a few weeks ago. The deepest secret is that life is not a process of discovery, but a process of creation. You're not discovering yourself but creating yourself anew. Seek therefore not to find out who you are. Seek to determine who you want to be. And that's from a great book called Conversations with God. What it is saying here and what I'm saying here traders, you have the chance to recreate, to remold yourself into that world class epic day trader. You can create your future using these techniques. Now, an amazing thing about the mind is this. The mind makes changes very, very quickly. And that's what you're going to discover is that 
a lot of what I show you you can do in 10 or 15 minutes and create lasting change in 10 or 15 minutes to last the rest of your life however like a finely tuned piano every now and then you might to might need to reapply some of the techniques I show you so what can the swish pattern be used for well developing self-confidence happiness patience focus um, getting you through things or two things such as fitness weight loss determination overcoming fear and of course it's an incredible tool to use when it comes to trading so let's talk about modeling for a moment exactly what is modeling why reinvent the wheel modeling traders is about finding someone that's already done something and discovering exactly how they do it what we call the syntax the order in what they do it or how they do it you've probably seen this slide in this statement in other presentations that I've given and it states this when you enter the highly competitive field of trading the novice trader should be aware that he is up against the finest sharpest and toughest minds in the business the fact is that over 90% of traders fail and you hear me quote this virtually every recording you've got to join the 5% club to win in this business why not model them you see you take these great master traders their physiology is exactly the same as yours and mine but they have a certain mindset a certain approach in how they approach things we can model that we can copy exactly what they're doing from a mental point of view now one thing and please write this down I'd really encourage you to do is to Google millionaire traders go and buy um, uh, stock market wizards the book go and buy the book millionaire traders and I want you to read and to study these traders and what you discover is virtually every one of these traders are normal guys uh, Dan uh, Dan what's his surname uh, Zanga um, he built swimming pools and he turned ten thousand dollars into forty two million dollars in two years and when you go and start to research all of these natural fact I've got a, a folder here called millionaire traders and when you go and research these guys they're normal guys like you and I Richard Dennis um, from the turtles he had this bet a uh, very very large bet where he could turn I think it was 100 traders into millionaire traders within a certain period of time he managed to achieve that with all bar three of these traders and they all achieved in one year a 100% return this is called modeling now where you can fast track your modeling is by basically copying what other great traders are doing but what we've got to do to be able to do that for a certain personal skills we need to develop besides the trading knowledge we need to develop some head stuff so let's talk about that for a moment so a critical question to ask ourselves is this who do we need to become to be one of the best traders in the world we want to model the world's best traders so what are the key attributes so what I've done is gone through and for years now I've been studying great traders and here's what I've discovered they are confident they are competent which we're going to talk about in a moment they're fast that is they don't stuff around they see a trade they move on it quickly they're aggressive some of the guys I deal with are outright grumpy but they're focused on the other hand they're very patient if their strategy means they've got to be patient they're patient they're disciplined they've got great self talk they're decisive and great physiology most of them <laughs> that is the way they sit the way they use their body now one thing I've got to bring up here right now is this now if there's any NLP practitioners or anyone that really understands NLP watching this you will understand and this may have already been going through your mind the technique I'm going to show you here and I'm not going to actually install the, the, the strategy I'm going to show you where to go and watch a great video on this is that 
um, you can develop incredible confidence but if you ever come across a confident incompetent person that is someone may have absolute confidence they can do it but yet they're no good at actually installing it for an example you or I can go and read a book or watch a video on how to fly an aircraft does that mean we're qualified to fly an aircraft of course not there's a huge difference a bit like brain surgery there's a ton of medical books the world's best medical books we could read and study we could learn them backwards but does that mean that we're confident or have the competence to go and cut someone's head open of course we're not we haven't developed the competence so what I'm giving here traders is a disclaimer in learning how to day trade the technique you're about to learn I want you to install absolute confidence in doing this however you need to earn or you need to become competent in undertaking the trading techniques by using a the simulator then starting off with one contract and building from there because this can be the swish pattern can be so powerful it can literally change your whole personality now you may be thinking well come on Freeman you're you're losing me here it is true trust me it really is so what you got to do is have the right strategies in doing this so spend the time still on your research and development and learning your trading systems now what can we use this for getting back to this as a trader we can use this for uh, we can instill for an example the thought pattern of never taking counter trend trades we can install the habit the pattern fast track it that we take every trade that qualifies we can overcome the fear of trading now these are all things however getting back to the being competent part you still need to obey the proper money management rules etc so all of this comes into play so this is why you need to spend a little time in in writing out what are the critical factors they follow their money management rules of course um, uh, they take every trade that qualifies now one of the greatest challenges I tend to find with some of the more experienced traders that have failed they've is they've got or develop uh, reflex actions on perhaps taking counter trend trades and of course they get chopped up using the swish pattern you can install the pattern uh, and remove the need or the impulse of taking counter trend trades you can do all of that now this is where it comes down I'm going to direct you to a video in a moment where I want you to go through this video now for my students I've actually with the link to this video I've actually sent you what you can see on your screen and with a little bit a little bit better explanation of the swish pattern so you'll have a, um, a PDF of this in writing and a little more on how to run this however you really need to see the video and we'll get to that in one sec so here's what you want to do is you want to see the unwanted state or behavior you have for an example you may use this as you'll see in this demonstration a moment, moment by Tony Robbins for biting your nails you'll see the picture that represents the habit or situation you'd like to change so if you're an impulse trader or perhaps you uh, have incredible fear when it comes to trading you want to be able to visualize that you then too want to get the desired state the new state you then want to adjust the submodalities now the submodalities is a sound the brightness etc and this is covered in the video so I'm not, I won't go through word for word here because this is covered in the video that you're about to watch so what we've got here is a Tony Robbins video which is recorded quite some years ago it must be at least 25 years ago so don't be shocked when you see him however uh, it is a very one of the best ones I've seen once again on YouTube if you go on um, uh, Google or oh, sorry <laughs> go on YouTube and search for NLP swish patterns and look at demonstrations 
Okay, for an example, one of the latest methodologies is rather than having it in your right hand and pulling it up as Tony does in this video, you can do it by using a slingshot. So you can have what they call a slingshot swish pattern that also works brilliantly. Now you also need to do this pattern at least 10 times. It'll take you five, 10 minutes. However, it may take you 15 minutes of practicing because it's a little strange when you first hear it, but also even learning to visualize. Now I know what some of you are thinking that, well, I can't visualize rubbish. If I was to ask you to close your eyes and to, um, uh, perhaps describe everything in your room mentally you're going to be visualizing the room you're sitting in right now as you go throughout that room and call out the sub the, the, the what you see in that room the colors etc we can all visualize so everyone can do this I don't want to keep harping on this but what if I could guarantee you that you could earn at least a hundred thousand dollars a year extra over and above what you're earning now would you do it well of course I can't guarantee because I don't know if you're really going to do this but this you know has huge potential traders when you watch me trade what gives me has really strengthened me as a trader is under undertaking the swish pattern and but in lots of areas such as doing my research such as um, uh, taking um, uh, you know doing statistics getting through things there's just so many applications so I'm going on a bit I don't want to keep repeating myself here so what I'd really like you to do is to spend the time on this because it's, it's going to be incredibly powerful so who are you going to model well once again here is what I typed up some time ago so my self wish was based on this and here's what I typed up I see myself modeling a room of hundreds now this is to do a confidence being competent and no hesitation this is teaching day traders and one of the statements is I take every trade that qualifies I follow my trading rules I learn from my mistakes I'm confident I'm competent I'm focused I'm patient I'm sharp I'm decisive I'm disciplined I'm friendly and I follow the 8 and 34 EMA now I visualized a trader doing that me in my bottom right hand and that's what I created the swish based upon that now if you didn't get all of that please simply rewind and write that out once again you might have to spend some time on this but what if you spend two or three hours today or tomorrow studying the swish pattern and the swish totally removed your fear of trading totally could remove the patterns that you're experiencing the negative patterns when it comes to day trading this is the power of the switch swish pattern sorry now what we are going to do with follow-up videos I'm going to cover how to anchor now you'll hear me hitting my fist together yes yes that is an anchor that I'm going to cover on another session what about the negative self-talk that you have as a trader when you have a losing trade that is a major issue we're going to talk about the rubber band technique which will really help overcoming that combined with the swish etc all of this will come together in future sessions so traders please go back and replay this follow the swish pattern uh, watch and study Tony Robbins on YouTube go back to the slide and watch him on that video it only goes for uh, I think it's eight and a half minutes watch it time and time again then install it and just in close remember what I mentioned earlier you may need to go back and do it again if you find yourself slipping back into your old habits go and do it don't give up okay and for the older traders you might have to do it four or five times in sets of ten maybe you do it once a day 
but you can change remember the mind thinks very very quickly and in a future session I'm also going to cover what we call the movie theater technique now if anyone wants to fast track their knowledge just go on just go on um, uh, Google and go on YouTube the movie theater technique NLP technique it's a way if you like imagine a CD and imagine if your bad habits had been inscripted on a CD or a DVD now take your coin and scratch that backwards and forwards over that CD or even over one of your old records you go to play it you can't play it any longer that's what NLP can do it can totally turn and really remove these bad habits but anyway let's start with the swish so traders let's just go back to this again go to this link go and watch it be open-minded the swish pattern will change your trading life forever thank you traders drop me an email any questions or to find out more about my program <music>